Summer loving happy ever last. Summer loving happened so fast. Simon Cowell's Grease is the Word took Danny Bien and Susan McFadden from obscurity to the West End. Sky's Neil Sean asks how they coped with the pressures of the show. We went out there every week and we gave it all we could, you know, and, uh, and they put us where we are today, so we're really thankful for that. Seven days You both gave sensational performances on the show, but who was the judge that kind of inspired you most and you kind of thought, you know what, I'm going to take notice of that, because the gorgeous David Ian, we all love, <laughs> he was sort of, was a bit scathed about some of the judges and I kind of thought, well, what do you feel when you're standing there, you know, and they're looking at you and you're thinking, oh, I've got to be nice because yeah. I need to hit this guy, well, who is it for you? Well, I know, for, I think most of us felt that was David Ian as well, that we are respected. Mm. Because, you know, and he was the producer of the show on many shows in the West End. He's a very so his, important man. Yeah, a very important man, and his opinion mattered the most, I think, for all of us. And also, also I mean, David Ian, big time, but also Brian Friedman. You know, for me, he's, he's an idol of mine as a dancer as well. And, um, you know, he's a great guy, and he's, he really knows the stuff. And he was very honest as well. Yeah. You know, he, he scared me a bit at the start, actually, but as the weeks went on, I sort of... He had his moments, grew, didn't he? grew to really like him, because you, you believe what he said. He was honest, you know, but... He had a good if he point. had to be rude, he was yeah. rude. If he didn't, he didn't. But you know, he's got his point across. Is he a good kisser? When he's not smoking. <laughs> <laughs> so he's a good, she's a good kisser. Yeah, she's not bad. Yeah. Apart from all the lip gloss and the yeah. lipstick and you know, <laughs> that little roll under the face. Kiss her on the cheek, darling. Right. <laughs>